Sour, sweet, gone. It's Sour Patch Kids crushing it today on the candy aisle. Welcome, welcome everyone. My name is Jeff. Today we have a review of the Sour Patch Kids Crush Flavored. That is right. The, the flavors you know and love from your favorite drink, Crush, are now uh, available in candy form uh, via Sour Patch Kids. So let's, let's have a look at what we got here. We've got, uh, yeah, sour, then there's, there, first they're sour, then they're sweet. Um, these are new. This product is uh, obviously Sour Patch Kids, so it's Maynard's. Um, came out in the Crush version of Sour Patch Kids. Came out alongside um, the Crush version of Swedish Fish. Both came out in uh, early 2020, so relatively new from when this is being recorded. Um, but if you know Crush, you know Crush. Uh, I, in, I think, honestly, in most parts of the world, the more popular um, fruit-flavored soft drink, soda, pop, you know, whatever you call it where you live, um, is, uh, is actually Fanta. But in the United States, at least, uh, I'm pretty positive that Crush is uh, much more popular. And I'm trying to remember if Crush, I think Fanta's the Coke product? Is Crush a PepsiCo product? I can't, I can't remember and I forgot to look that up. Join the crew, hmm, interesting. Crush soda inspired flavors. But Crush is great. I, I always like Crush. Uh, here in Canada, I grew up uh, drinking um, Crush sometimes. Or, um, you know, there was a couple other orange, like Orange Crush obviously is the classic. I know grape, orange and grape are kind of tied for like the most popular Crush flavors, I think. Um, but uh, I never really drank much grape, but I drank a lot of Orange Crush, and um, as well as uh, the other ones, at least you could get here in Canada, which would have been um, uh, C Plus. Uh, there was a Minute Maid, made a, which is a Canadian brand, made a, made a um, orange soda. Um, yeah, uh, there was one more. Eh, maybe it was just those two. Anyway, here are the flavors. You got Orange Crush, you got Grape Crush, you have... Uh, Cherry and, uh, is that cherry and pineapple? No, strawberry and, uh, pineapple. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen pineapple crush. Um, but maybe. I know when I lived overseas, I, uh, I saw pineapple Fanta quite a lot. Um, is that a corollary? I don't know, maybe. Anyway, um, crush has a really distinctive sort of flavor. If you know it, you know it. Um, this feels like, I don't know how long this has been sitting around, not too long, I mean obviously it's a fairly new product. It feels like there's a lot of powder in it. Where am I, I'm missing one, what am I missing? Oh my god, so much <laughs> sour powder falling everywhere. Alright, let's see, what do we got here? So we got our pineapples, we got our oranges, is that, wait, is that a strawberry? That's a strawberry, sorry. Pineapple, orange, strawberry, grape. Yeah. Okay. Well, in that handful, lots of uh, lots of pineapple and lots of grape. That's okay. Let's uh, let's dive into it, huh? They don't smell any different than regular Sour Patch Kids. As you can see, there is the Sour Patch Kids um, design work here. Always thought it was weird. Like sometimes you get the designs and it's really clear, and sometimes it's very hard to tell. It is a little kid though. See, they got the bumpy hair on top. I don't know. There's so much powder on it too, the sour powder. It's like, it's hard to tell. Anyway, that's why they're obviously sour than they're sweet because the powder on the outside is sour. The gummy is sweet. Let's give the grape sour patch crush, kids crush flavor a try. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Ooh. I don't know what, I don't know what I was expecting. I was like forgetting what a Sour Patch Kid was for a second there. First, I was surprised that it was so, um, you could chew right through it. Of course, I was thinking of like a gummy bear for some reason. No, no, no. This is like a real progressive sort of chew. You can just bite right through it. Really nice gummy flavor. Um, and then I was like, whoa, it's sour. I forgot. They are called Sour Patch Kids, guys. And they're not very sour. And the sour only lasts for a little bit. But boy... Is it good? So tangy, so sharp. Mmm. Hmm. Okay. I mean, 
It's grape. Could I pick that out of a lineup as like crush grape? Yeah, maybe. Um, if I think about it, knowing it, yeah, I think I probably could. If someone just handed it to me, I don't think I could. Let's try orange. The most classic of all crush flavors. I am HO. Um, what a cutie. Okay. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That works. It's like, because it's like sour with the sour orange. Um, very good. Like, the orange has that edge, that kick to it anyway. Man, I want another one of those. Nothing of particular interest to see on the inside. Obviously, no more powder on the inside. Mmm. That's good. I want more orange. Is that an orange? There's a strawberry. All right. You know what? Okay. I can eat these after. <laughs> I want more. <laughs> They're so good. All right. Um, mm. uh, orange is good. Totally good. Again, maybe I think if someone told me this is a Crush-inspired flavor. Like, Crush has a distinctive flavor. It's one of those things. It's like, it's not just some straight-up orange. Like, it's like, um, as much as I'm not a big fan of Jolly Ranchers, the flavors on Jolly Ranchers are extremely distinctive. Just like Skittles, my favorite candy. The flavors on Skittles, very distinctive. Really pops. Skittles and Starburst have that same kind of pop to the uh, fruit flavor. Um, Crush has a distinctive flavor. Knowing it, going in, I, can f I feel like I can taste it. If someone asked me just randomly to try this, I'd say that's good orange sour candy. I wouldn't necessarily say Crush. Strawberry. An odd one, but I like it in principle. Ooh, that was really sour. That one had some extra powder on it. Um, huh. Yeah. Strawberry's not doing it for me. Nope. Um, What is this? Sorry, strap. It is a strawberry, isn't it? Is it? I guess pineapple, orange, grape. Yeah, pineapple, orange, grape, and strawberry. Um, strawberry's not doing it for me. I think the strawberry flavor itself is a little subtle. Um, it's also very sweet. Like, I think the sour is a little overpowering on the strawberry flavor. So, not my favorite. It just like I love strawberry, obviously, but. It just doesn't fit as well with um, with this, you know, configuration. But maybe if Strawberry Crush is a popular flavor that I'm not aware of, I don't know. Pineapple, okay, so here was my thing about the Fanta Pineapple. I wonder if that means that, like, in other countries or in other places that I'm not aware of, maybe Pineapple Crush is very popular. Um, let me know what kind of crush is popular where you live, if they even have it, you know? Hmm. Pineapple is actually, I think, a very good choice to mix with sour, because it's already got that citrus tang. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I like it. It's not too sour. It's, um... A really nice, smooth, smooth aftertaste. Mmm. Oh, that's great. What a pleasant surprise. I wasn't sure about the pineapple, but totally good. Totally good. So, you know what, guys? Like, overall, these are really good. Um, I gotta give them a, a big, uh, big, big ups. Big big props for this one. I think they did a good job putting this together. The only, my only suggestion would have been kill the um, strawberry and you know what? Replace it with cherry. That would have been a much better fit for a sour um, flavoring. 
a sour pairing, right? Sour cherry, that's like fairly common. This crush must make a cherry crush, right? Or like, um, does crush do a cream soda? That'd be a nice, tr that'd be something neat to try, right? And really distinctive rather than just straight fruit flavors. Anyway, that would have been my suggestions, but um, grape, pineapple, and orange are all, um, they're all winners, I would say. Um, and uh, I think this product is, is well worth a try. Um, you know, obviously I love Sour Patch Kids regularly. I think they're a five-star candy, but I don't go out of my way to get them too often. My wife, however, is like her favorite candy. So they are in the house a fair bit. I just find that because I'm doing reviews of other things, I try not to eat her candy, you know, because I always have other candy lying around. So I don't eat Sour Patch Kids as much as I would like because they are good. But I think I'm going to keep eating these because um, these are um, excellent. So walking the candy out, I'm going to rate these a 4.5 out of 5. Um, it's worth picking up, worth checking out. I still think that the original Sour Patch Kids or Sour Patch Kids Extreme are still probably better just overall um, and a classic. Who knows how long this crush flavor um, of Sour Patch Kids will last in, more, in stores. So I recommend you go and uh, find it now while you can. Anyway, that's my take on it. Have you had a chance to try the Sour Patch Kids crush flavors? If so, please let me know what you think in the comments below. I thank you very much for your time. Please check out any other videos that uh, might be of interest. More Sour Patch Kids videos are here on the channel. And I will talk to you guys next time. So long, everyone. Bye-bye.